wrap. I think I just landed one of the best campsites I've ever had here at Lake Kachima. This is all to myself, this whole section. No neighbors there, just nice green grass, like super green grass. Hey, I don't drive, right? But why doesn't why does Chin get a nicer car? Do you think he's trying to like act cool or something or whatever? Why don't you just get a nicer whip? Why would you drive such a shit car? Actually, let me let me center my screen a little bit. Why would you why why would you get such a terrible car? Why not just buy something a little bit more, you know, akin to your social status? Why would you purposely buy something so terrible looking? Is that like a flex thing to look like you don't really care about cars or something? I don't understand it. Lakeside, all this area to myself, and there's a uh, campers over there in their RV, but. I mean, this whole section is... Like, I'm not saying you should have a Porsche, but just something a little bit better than that fucking, you know, than the Prius. You shouldn't have a Porsche, but something just a tad bit better than that Prius. To myself, this is pretty dang cool. And this is Campsite 480. Why do we need to know that? I told you guys I'm going to keep making sure that you guys know which campsites I go to so you can visit it as well if you like the way it looks. Yeah, and Definitely, everyone's running to the campsites that you go and visit, mate. If they're going there, they're going there to try and see if there's any dead bodies around. I'm pretty sure you're going to like the way this place looks, because, I mean, come on. Like the way the dick tastes? Seriously. This is so dope. <laughs> Someone put this cool Budweiser cover on this. Cool, you know. He says it's cool. That guy said that cover is cool. Cool. Okay. I guess that's one way to describe it, my, my friend. Cool. It's not the way I describe that fucking horrible student art project shit you got there. Doesn't look cool to me, but hey, cool is subjective, I guess. I'll use it. All right, before it gets too dark, let's see if I can show you this shot here. It's kind of blocked, but how cool does that look? Again, the, the word cool is the being overused in this fucking stream already. Cool. Moonlight there. And the reflection on the lake. You should be with somebody in a place like this, huh? It should be a great place to take a girl or a guy or something in between. You should see all these type of moments. It is quite nice. I'm, I'm going to give it to him. I'll take it back. But to just witness all this shit on your own is a little bit depressing. I'm not going to lie. It's actually quite a nice landscape, you know, situation going on there. And to do it all by yourself. Oof. Trees blocking it and so is this pole, but still looks really cool. Okay, gotta set up my tent. I don't know, does that meat look like it's gone through them? Is, does that meat look like he, does that meat look human? <laughs> Number one. Does it look edible? Number two. Like, I don't know, like the color of that isn't good. I don't know, the color of that is a bit mad, isn't it? Or am I bugging? The color of that is a bit mad. The thickness is crazy on that kind of grill also. You could probably cut that in half and probably get two bits of bob in it, right, if you wanted to, but maybe I'm maybe I'm being a little bit too much. Some asparagus there, cool. Trying to get his greens in, I guess. Is that how he seasons? How the how are you how do you season your steak on the fire? Why don't you just rub it in and have it wrapped before you get there? And then when you get there, on a journey there, it gets time to marinate. Not that long. We should marinate longer. But why not rub it in while you're, like, preparing your stuff in your home? Wrap it in some cling film or foil or whatever. When you get there, it's nice and marinated, and you just pull up it on the fucking grill. Why is he just sprinkling, like, shit on top, like... He cooks like a white, like, not even a white, white people, why, white people don't cook like this. I'm taking it back. Why people don't cook like this? This is some weird way of cooking. Like, why would you cook like this? Why? It feels like it's like. He just puts a massive potato on there as well. Like, this is a weird way to fucking cook, man. I was lost in conversation on the phone, so I didn't check the food. Lost in conversation on the phone. Yeah, right. Who are you talking to? Your mum. 
I was lost. You had one job to cook a bit of steak and some potatoes and veggies on an open fire, and you still managed to fuck it up. Jesus Christ, bro. That steak has been absolutely barbecued. Oh my goodness. Look at I that. It. Oh my God. We can tell from the looking at it. It's not even flexing. That completely is unedible. That is like gone charcoal. Fucking hell, bro. He's destroyed the bit of steak. That was a massive T-bone take. As well. That's a, probably quite expensive. Why is my... Do I drop this too? Why is he recording the balloons on the social Damn media? It. He's so horrible at oh, cooking. This is the most burnt. Oh my god. Oh my god, man. Absolute travesty. Look at that shit. Look at that shit. Look what he's done to it. He's burned it to a singe. It's been charcoal. It's been fucking charcoal. He charcoaled that entire steak. It's gone. It's done. It's finished. Oh my fucking god. How did he manage to do that? Never had in my life. These asparagus? Oh, boys. Boys and girls of the chat. Boys and girls and everything else in between of the chat. He burned the potato. Boys and girls of the chat and everything else in between. He burned the fucking potato. He burned a potato. Are you fucking serious? He's burned asparagus. Look. He's burned the fucking asparagus and the potato. <laughs> oh my fucking God. He's burned the potato and the fucking asparagus. He's fucking burned it all. He's burned it all. He's burned the whole thing. The whole thing has been charred. This is fucking steak BBQ. This is camping BBQ. He's taken his experience of cooking on an open fire. And at Korea. Well, he must be used at Korean barbecue, right? If he's burning this, what is he like at Korean barbecue? He must be hopeless. Still burnt and I keep dropping. Oh, oh my God, bro. I'm terrible at this. I realized later the but, tips uh, of my tongues are bent out of shape. That bad. That bad. Look at that. That bad. Look at that. Oh my! I the right tool. Oh, I just dropped. <gasps> okay. Where's the potato gone? You know what I hate the most about Chin? You know what I hate the most about Chin? You know what I hate the most about Chin and his videos? He's got a MacBook here. He's got a MacBook here. You can't see in the screen, but he's got a MacBook there, right? Some sort of MacBook. Maybe a MacBook Air, maybe a MacBook Pro. One thousand plus dollars. He's got the newest iPhone, thousand plus dollars. He's probably got some crazy lamp, five hundred pounds. He's got his camera equipment, his GoPro, all this stuff. It's probably like ten grand of equipment he takes with him, and he can't afford to take a couple of plates with him. Even fucking paper plates, I fucking hate. You can't take paper plates. You just take a cutting board and you use that as a makeshift plate. You don't even take proper cutlery. You have plastic knives and plastic forks to cut into steak you don't even have a steak knife you can take with you all that money you spend on equipment and shit and you can't make yourself take a fucking plate a regular plate just to eat and you don't have to take what you don't have to take seven one decent plate that can double up as a bowlish type thing just a decent plate a camping plate a plate from your fucking kitchen whatever one good steak knife, one good fork, one good spoon. That's all you need. And one good plate and one good cup to put your fucking drinks in. No, we're going to put it on a fucking cutting board. <sighs> so I pretty much ruined the steak. Yeah, you did, bro. It's fucking it burned. And as you can see, it's a little bit on the crispy side. Look at that face. Is he trolling us? You know what he kind of looks like? Doesn't Chin a bit look like Fresh from Fresh and Fit? Walter Fresh. Does he look like him? Or am I bugging out? Do they have the same pug face? Doesn't Chin look a bit like Walter? Where is it? No, it's not the picture there. Famous bird. Let's see there. Am I bugging out? Or does Chin not look a little bit like Fresh from Fresh and Fit? What do you guys think? Am I bugging?
Am I bugging or does Chi not look a bit like him? What do you guys think? What do you guys think? What do you guys think? Don't they look kind of similar? Don't they look kind of similar? Kind of. Kind of. Anyway, let's continue. But we shall see how it is. And I'm using a plastic fork and plastic knife. Of course you are, because you're a bozo. Not too bad. Jesus Christ, bro. That is so... Look how chewy that is. He's going to try and pretend. Look, that, 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 that sounds like chewing gum. You can hear it from the way he's chewing. Let me replay it to you one more time. Let's, look, 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 look at his mouth where he's chewing. He's trying to, he's trying to sell it well because he fucked up a fucking good piece of steak he's probably spent a good bit of money on. But listen to how he chews. Listen to his chew. Listen to his chew. Too bad. That's actually pretty good. <laughs> yeah, of course you say that. He, he has no discernible... You can't trust Chin when it comes to quality of food because he'll eat anything. He eats 7-Eleven food, food he finds on the floor. Like, he's not he's not the best judge of what good food is. He's just, you know, he's got a fucking small intestine, you know, a stomach, a, a digestive system made out of fucking adamantium or something. Let me put some A1 steak sauce on this. If you have to have steak sauce on your steak, your steak is not cooked properly and you haven't seasoned it well. It's like putting ketchup on your steak. You haven't cooked it well. Sorry, you haven't. You didn't season it well. You didn't prepare it well. It is what it is. That's why you have to cover it in fucking steak to get it to taste good. What next? Cheese. Brand new. God, honestly, the lack of plate is annoying me, man. This can't can you cut that bit? Why does it, why does it have that bit where you're shaking like you've got Alzheimer's? Thick and hearty. It's really good. Yeah, of course. Fucking hell, bro. He just eats, okay. He eats anything, get it? He's just a waste of space, bro. But why would you just waste of cooking materials, waste of produce, waste? Good night, sweet dreams. I'm going to finish all this stuff, and uh, I'll see you tomorrow morning. I'm going to try to catch fish and make a catch and cook out of this video, but we'll see. Good night, sweet dreams. Yuck. He took it out of the fucking container. Look what it looked like. Whatever he storage. Look. That looks pretty bad anyway. Maybe it's been oxidized and that's probably the only reason, but it doesn't look too great there. It's a still an amazing piece of meat that should have been seasoned, that should have been marinated. It should have been just ready to go on the grill. Done. You're ready to fucking eat that shit. Medium rare. But look at it. It's already been oxidized. No seasoning. No, nothing's been done. No preparation. No even like stabs on the steak to make the seasoning seep in. Nothing. Just took it from the wrapping paper. Put it on there. No care in the world. Then the asparagus just... He just moves it off the center. Puts it near the edge where all the main heat is. Asparagus doesn't... Oh, I didn't notice he didn't carve the stems by the way. Doesn't wash the asparagus, doesn't cut off the stems, nothing. Just plops them all on there raw. No preparation. And then just starts to sprinkle salt and pepper or whatever on top of the fucking steak. That's not seasoning, brother. That what is that? Or oh, that is. That's maybe seasoning, it's not marination, I guess. And then it pops up where the, where, what happened to that potato? The potato that he didn't the potato you threw away. Feels like it's like uh, sixty something degrees. And then look, he forgot it, and then he turned around and it's completely burned. Look at that, look at that. It's got from you could that's not edible. Just throw that in the bin, or cut it up and put it into a burrito or something. Look at the other side. Oh my goodness! Fuck, I burned he's it. Burned. I think he's dropping the asparagus. I damn it. Why is my do I drop this too? How can you not quickly just flick over the asparagus using the stems? Why can't you just quickly take your fingers and just twist them just to kind of make them cook on the other side? Do you really need to use your tongs to flip over asparagus? Is it really that difficult to do? You can't just quickly roll them around each other. Is it really that hard to, to roll asparagus around here on the stems and just make sure they're just cooked on either side? Dang it. And I mean, look this at is the most burnt. 
Look at P7. that steak. Look at that. Look at that. Ladies and gentlemen, that's another screenshot need to be taken. Oops, wrong person. Uh, another screenshot. Oops, wrong person again. <laughs> another screenshot. What am I doing here? That needs to be taken. Look at that. Look at this. Look at that, guys. Look at that. Look at this. Look at that piece of steak. Please, for the love of God, look at that. Look at that. But he destroyed a lovely, as Mexican salsa says, premium cut of fucking steak. Just destroyed. Because Chin touched it. Look at that. Fucking. Oh, what? Side by side comparison is fucking hilarious. <laughs> I'm not gonna that's that's a bit Uche is now being incredibly incredibly racist look at that Uche is saying fresh looks like a burnt piece of steak that is mad that is mad Uche is saying that Uche is calling fresh a burnt piece of steak <laughs> that is mad that is mad oh my god that is fucking crazy I'm not taking part in that at all I'm not taking part in that at all Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ. <laughs> <sighs> but yeah, Chin is a special kind of redacted, man. Chin is a special kind of redacted. Then he tries to lie when he's eating. Steak out of Look how he lied when he eats. Look when he's lying. Still, Look at that. You even burn the asparagus, brothers. Burnt, and I keep dropping a lot of them. The potatoes inside has been completely decimated. I'm terrible at this. You're but, terrible uh, at everything, bro. Except for podcast producing, you're terrible at everything. They look him trying to eat it, look, look. Oh, we shall see how it is. I'm using a plastic fork and plastic knife. Look his look 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 his lying face. Not look his bad. look his lying face. Look his face lying. That is so chewing. Look at that. That's, That's actually pretty good. Yeah, you lie. You lie. You're lying. You're lying. You're lying. We know you're lying. Let me put some And look at the lie, yeah, look at the lie. I'm gonna eat this and I'm gonna turn it off because I wanna finish Sauce. eating. You eat some camera and then dad doesn't eat on camera. Why don't you want to eat on camera anymore? Thick and hearty. It's really good. Pause on that one. Listen. Eating the burnt food. It wasn't tasty at all. Okay. Let's see. Look. Good night. Sweet dreams. I'm going to finish all this stuff. No, you're not. You're going to finish anything. That's that's a lie. I'm going to finish all this okay. stuff. Good night. Sweet dreams. I'm, I'm going to finish, finish all this stuff. stuff. And uh, I'll see you tomorrow morning. Night. See you tomorrow morning. I'm going to finish all this stuff. I'm gonna put this after good use. I'm gonna finish all this stuff. Yeah, no, you're not. Don't lie. You're not gonna finish anything. Oh, that was fucking brilliant. That was absolutely fucking brilliant. I loved everything about it. I'm gonna finish all this stuff. I'm gonna finish all this stuff. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. <laughs>